All right, we are back. Seems like uh, my computer went in defensive mode and shut itself off after I got tripped up in the cord of the freaking um, headphones, which I've got to be really careful of. That's how I broke my last headphones. Fantastical. All right, we're back anyway. Part two. <laughs> Damn game. I came back and the computer was off. What's going on? Because I usually don't just leave like that unless the power goes out. Or the internet. Alright, now we changed everything around. Hopefully it remembered it. So we've had the goose hunt. We've done part one. Alright, so it looks like I remembered everything. Let's check equipment. Alright, beautiful. Dog's not with me. I might bring the other dog. We haven't brought it out for a while. So equipment. Dog. This dog. Seven. There she is. She's a good dog. Alright, fresh hunt. Ah, pig's red deer. Oh. So I don't know how that happened though. Why the computer went off. That was super weird. Oh, that's a fellow deer, right? Is it a male? It's a male, is it? Could be a male. It's over there. Let's get up on the hill. Load the guns. It's always handy. Make the dog sit down in a minute. Behind me, these trees. Dog. Lay down. Good girl. Yeah, so if you're watching before, sorry about that. I got tangled up in the headphone cord and the computer turned itself off for some reason. Always oh, something going on. Alright, so it's over there somewhere. It must be over the hill. So we're just going to have to wait and hopefully it's a male. We will see if it comes. This is the, this is for the fellow deer, right? At least that's what I've been using. <laughs> I don't have to have a specific core, I've been using this. Well, mine am, uh, another male fell idea. I don't have many. We'll see if it comes in. I'm hoping it does. So there we go. We've got a part two today because of my uh, clumsy mistake. I just still don't know why the computer went off. It's a bit weird. I know the elephant shook. Maybe that's why. The whole table shook. It was like, earthquake, earthquake. <laughs> Not an earthquake. They look all red deer while we're here too. Let's see if we can, uh, you get, sometimes a female fellow deer move really quick where the males do tend to, uh, 
come in slower. I wish I had a call again. I wish the headphones didn't break. I have to buy cordless ones, huh? I give up now. Come on in, baby. This is where I got my first couple of fellow deer was around this area. They do seem to like the paddocks. Oh, that sounded like a male. Oh, yeah, this way. Oh my god. So we've got multiple. Look at the hunter mate again. It's not going to be super accurate because uh, it's over here somewhere. I hope for the wind's good. Uh, let's just keep calling. Oh, there it is, there it is. Is that it? It's a small male. It's better than a female. Oh, come on. Didn't I hit you? Yeah, I hit you. And there goes a female there. All right, let's pick it up, man. Call the dog. Ah, a fellow deer. It's a nice thing. I was going to say, oh, I hit that man. Aim for the chest. So usually you hit a lung when you do that. Oh, that's what I probably should bring is the... I'll go back to the tent in a minute. I want to get the pheasant locator. Can't call them in, but you can locate them. So we'll pick up this. What's the blood saying? Just saying fling? Is it telling me about the blood? Yeah, it's only tiny, man. Ah, what have we got here? We hit the body. Alright, so crap shot, but it still killed it. 34. 100% uh, trophy integrity. Harvest value was only 92. Alright, so let's run back to our tent and I'll get the pheasant locator. So it's handy to have that on this map. I give a whistle every now and again, and the, the males always answer. So we'll grab that. Alright, we've had our goose hunt, so we're not doing geese now. First one was geese. We've got a couple of pigs. And uh I broke the computer. <laughs> so let's get pheasant locator for here, which is this. I'm not bringing the fox call. I don't have a fox gun on me, so, you know. Weird sound thing, but it works. You can't call them in, but you can locate them. So we're just going to walk around so we can find red deer, wild boar, fellow deer, pheasant. And, uh, yeah. Let's see how we go, man. Alright, give me where I'm at. It's going to put a dot. Where am I? Which way am I walking? Why can't I say myself? We're going to head probably down this way or we can just do it like a circle. Alright, so that's this way. I 
And it says pheasant over there. I saw one walking. Yep, there we go. See, one answered. It's usually only the males that answer. So, we'll head towards him. Shotgun is loaded. And uh, when we get near him, if we can spot him, we'll just whistle and make him fly. And uh, see, there's one. Oh, there he is there. Look, he's a nice one. The big old boy. And he's got a female with him. So we'll just sneak up a bit closer. Usually if they're not facing you, you can get sort of pretty close. So. That panic. Although sometimes they tend to run. <laughs> Instead of flying, they run off. It's like, no, I want you to fly. There he is, there he is. He's flapping his wings, man. I'm going to try and get a bit behind him on the side here. So I don't want him to, him to see us walking up. They're a nice model, aren't they, the, the pheasant in this game? They're actually not too bad. And that's why you bring the pheasant locator, because there is a ton of them on this map. Just can you sit still, and not walk too much? When you walk, then I've got to walk. Right, it's gone down a dip. I can't see you now. Is that you there? Wild ball female. This is our thing. There's our, there's our boy. All right, get ready. There goes the wild ball. I just saw it run. Oh, another one. Did I hit that? Let's get the male first. There's another freaking male. I don't know if I hit the second one. Where's our boy? Is he here? Here he is. The other one was the female that flew over. Oh, we hit the body. You're going to get 31. Nice. Let's go back here. Hopefully we hit the female as well. The first shot was bodgy, but uh, maybe the second shot done the job. Yes, it did. It's hiding under the hay here. And we're going to get four. So let's do the pheasant locator again. There is another one calling somewhere. So let's do if you just scan around. You'll see him in the distance because the grass goes away through the binoculars. So you can sort of see through it. Ah, well, hopefully he calls. Oh, there he is, he called. It's a male and it's over this way. Oh, we've got three uh, bullets left in this gun. See, see how close we got to him, just in crouch, and then just give the old whistle, and uh, get him in the air. Give him a blast and mate. Alright, so two streams today. Oh, it should just be one big fat one, but now we're going to have two sort of shorter ones. Which is fine, it's all good, it all works out. 
Give me another hoot. Oh, he called without a hoot. Is that another mark? Oh, no, same one. Look up. He's going to run away. <laughs> I was looking for the pheasant and the wild ball come up on the spotting. But then when I shot the pheasant, I could see a run off behind. you got to watch them. They will kill you. And sometimes when you're doing this, you can sneak up on them and you don't see them and they run out and go boom and you're dead. It's like, no. Yeah, so when we had that pheasant competition, I got my 20 pheasant pretty quick. Like, it didn't take long. So, yeah, if you are a pheasant hunter, probably come here and not Loggers Point and you'll tend to get more of them. And plus, when they're out there, you see them really excellently. Like, you see them really good. He's called again. He sounds closer. Oh, he's closer. Let's see if we can spot him. Should be near that hay bale somewhere. There he is. He is near the hay bale. And we want to sort of get round behind him a bit. We don't want to be um, heading towards him. Trying to just sneak around and get behind him. Who needs geese when you got pheasants? I like the bird hunting in this game. I think it's superior than uh, Call of the Wild. Myself. Uh, he didn't spot us that he's gone there like a crouch. Uh, I think he's just relaxing. I'm going to get in a bit behind him. Now if you do have your Labrador with you, the, the Labrador can pick up the pheasants. Alright, so now he's dead in front of us. Just going to get a tad closer. You just don't want him to run. That's the worst thing is when they run. You want him in the air. Alright, we're pretty close. Oh, that was bad because he... Oh, he came up. And then he went backwards. So it just seemed really weird. We got a femur. Oh, there's another one. Line up through them trees. Is that the one? Did we kill this female? Did we missed both of them? Oh, I think we did. You mongrel. Now, with these things, sometimes I just fly to the next paddock. I can't believe I missed that female. Why am I shooting bad? Go away, goose. We don't want you now. We have, uh, we've hunted you the first hunt. It was fantastical. <laughs> oh, we didn't get too many. We got over ten, but uh, we didn't get tons and tons. As soon as the, like, when you shoot them, they just fly into the next panic. I know, weird, right? Oh, we're going to keep walking to the way I said I wanted to go anyway. There'll be plenty more uh, pheasants. Oh, so he's straight away. Ah, he is in the next paddock. Let's go crouch again. I got one bullet in the gun. <laughs> might, as well use, might as well use it. I wish you could stack them when there's like one and two. Wish you could add them together. Like you not have a like a stray sort of thing happening. Stray bullets. Yeah, so if you are uh, pheasant hunting, you shoot at one and it flies off, just call again, because they, they don't go far. They sort of fly like a chicken. You know, they fly a bit, then they just land back down again. 
So it's um, good hunting pheasant. I actually enjoy it. I'm pretty sure there's wood grass on this uh, map. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. Sort of sure. I do have that wood grass, that core, that box thing. It's pretty weird, but it works. But they are, they can see you. You know, you got to be really still on that when you hunt them. Uh, this thing should just be down here somewhere. Look at my hunter, mate. Yeah. Uh, let's uh, use the binoculars. Oh, there he is, there he is. Hello, hello chicken. Can we get you the... Don't do the stall fly, you took off then went backwards. You're like you rubber banded yourself and that's why I'd... it was just... It stuffed me up, mate. Now he's probably going to be a little bit nervous because... Uh, you know, we took a bang at him and missed. Oh. Watch him, watch him. Alright, got him that time. Let's uh, reload our gun with 30. Always a bit better. Uh, so I've got another male. Stand up. Have a little, little trot because we just shot the gun, so it doesn't matter. Hello. Uh, 29. They pay alright, don't they? For, you know, just a bird, really. They pay not bad, mate. Alright, we'll just keep calling this thing every now and again and. See if one answers, man. Uh, I don't mind walking around this map, actually. It's quite pleasant. It reminds me of walking around a golf course. Of course, it's not as manicured as a golf course, but it's still pretty. Skippy came back. Hey, Haggis, how you going? Good to see you, mate. Happy Easter. And we're close to uh, Once Human, mate. You got it all updated? 3rd April, I think they said. So will that be the 4th of April for us, for me? Is that like a 3rd of April in America? <laughs> I'm so ready for that game. Hopefully, uh, Boomslang can get in. Haven't, uh, seen him for a while, so I don't, I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, you looking forward to it? Yeah, me too. Apparently now, you know, when you build the house, right? When you build your, your little hut or your house or mansion like I built. Apparently this time they're gonna, when you build it, you don't have to repair it, but you've got to go there before seven days are up or it'll disappear. I think it's the same if you build a hive, right? Because people were saying it was uh, taking a lot of gameplay away to keep, you know, chopping down wood and grabbing copper and refixing their house. So I'm pretty sure this time you don't have to maintain your house, but you, as long as you're there, you know, before a week's up. Because if you're not there within a week, your house is just going to totally disappear, I think. So that's one good thing. Yeah, that is good. So no maintenance now. Which I'm quite happy about. And the AI are going to be a lot better, they reckon. So yeah, we'll have to find out what Boom Slang's doing. Because, uh... I tried to ask Skippy if he wanted to come in. He didn't answer. He went and got a coffee. But then my computer went off because I tripped over a cord. 
And uh, we're, we're back again. Female wild boar. Let's have a look over here. Let's see if we can find a male with the females there. Find the right caller. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it, man. Apparently, I don't know, I was reading their thing. I think 7,700,000 people uh, want to get in the game. Have, like, registered or whatever. He's been playing Nightingale. All right, that's the game he told me about. Yeah, sorry about that, Sarge. I tripped over my um, headphone cord and the whole desk was shaking like an earthquake and the computer just went off, so... I didn't realise until I come back to the bathroom that the computer had gone off. So, part two. We're having part two of this uh, hunt today. Because I nearly broke everything. <laughs> but we are back. We're back. Yeah, so 3rd of April which is probably 4th of April for us. I'm not 100% sure. But uh, I'm looking forward to it, man. Getting back into that game. 42 days the beat is going to go for. When are we going to have a classic hunt badge? Well, probably soon now that you've asked. I've been doing this every week, mate. Even when I'm not streaming it, I've been playing on and off. We had a goose hunt and duck hunt last week with Ellie. I uh, better watch out. This pig doesn't come up over the rise at me. Uh, where are you? Where are you? Well, you're a different one. You're a male. You're across the river. You can cross right here. I think we can cross. I just want to see where this female is because I don't want it to run up and kill me. It was right on the edge of this freaking river. So I'm pretty sure that we might be able to cross. Let's call and see if we can get the male pig to uh, happen. You still suck at it? You still suck at this game? I like this game. You just gotta have a bit of patience, you gotta take your time. You gotta en enjoy the, you know, the map you're playing on. You know, if you're starting out in the game, probably Logger's Point's a good one because you can shoot every animal with the guns they give you. You can shoot the deer with, like, what if they give you a 243 or 223 or something? It's a 243. And the shotgun, you can shoot the pheasant and the rabbits. And you can uh, put slugs in it and shoot the feral pigs. But I've been playing this every week. Uh, anyway, to me, this is better than Call of the Wild. But everyone's different. Did you get the new gun pack in uh, Call of the Wild? I didn't. <laughs> You're going to go offline soon. You get your internet upgraded. Oh, cool. What, even faster? You got a super fast internet as it is. Where are you getting that upgraded to? Speed of light? <laughs> That's all right, you're getting ready for the... You'll be ready then for Once Human. I can't wait till that game becomes permanent. You know, I know we're having a, a next beta. Then I think they'll have another beta after that. And then quarter three this year it'll be uh, on Steam. And it'll be free. And everyone can play. Oh, there's our piggy. Hello. Give him another toot on the horn. 
I don't know where that female went, and I'm hoping she's gone. I hope she doesn't sneak up behind me and smash me. Okay, it has happened before in this game. Oh, now I've lost eyes on the male. He's here somewhere. Did he stop? That's alright, upgrade internet. I'm, oh, there he is. I might go for another package soon. I'm just on free floating, so I can cancel it anytime I want. But I might get a package soon, so it's cheaper. Because they recently put the price up, which is, uh, mongrels, you mongrels. Why you put the price up? Because of the... Uh, I don't know why they keep putting prices up there for everything, man. Drives me crazy. Oh, he's an average pig. He's probably about 400 and something. Let's let him walk in. He'll be closer. Hopefully he goes over here where it's shallow. Because uh, you can't shoot them in the water if they drown. And then, oh, that's it, mate. There's another... And another pig behind him. He'll be moving a bit weird. Oh, give him another two to the horn. Try and force him to come over here where it's shallow. I'm pretty sure I can walk across there because you can see rocks coming out. Oh, he's in the grass there. Good piggy. So they look like a catered distance, these models, but I think when you're close up to them, they do look a bit ugly. I suppose it's not a big deal, but you know, if they are gonna redo some of the animals, the pigs would be a good one. I was hoping they'd have the giant turkeys again. But they haven't done it for a couple of years. Remember they had the turkeys and they were like huge and giant? It was funny. I liked it. They were bigger than me. <laughs> you couldn't miss them. Felt like you had to use an elephant gun on them, but no, you didn't. Uh, don't go in the real deep water, because you know I can't walk in it. I can't even jump two inches in this game. Damn your game. He's an ugly bugger, isn't he? Not the best looking animal in the world, the old wild boars. They're pretty fugly, i got to say. Come on in, piggy. Yeah, so that's too deep for me to walk in. That sounds weird, but it's true. So just gonna have to be patient. Techie's here, no worries, take it easy. Uh hey guys, yeah, catch you on Discord. We'll get in contact with uh Boom Slang and uh get that once human thing happening, man. Third April. Third April. It's all happening. Alright, get on the shore there, buddy. And try and brain pop ya. Got us another pig. Uh, this could be worth, I don't know, 20 to 30. Tusks aren't that big. Brain shot, lung, 20 to 30. 
27. So I was close, 20, 30. Sort of close there. Ah, yeah, go away, goose. We're not looking for you now. We uh, we had the goose hunt. So no red deer yet today, unfortunately. But uh, you know, if we get one, we get one. If we don't, we don't. Val de Bois, whatever you call it, that is a good place for a deer walk along the river there. You get a fair few of them. You do get them here. But uh, they are a bit um, on and off. What is this? This could have been our, what is this, our female pig from before? Oh, it's a fellow deer. Oh, we've got a male, um, oh, he's, uh, Could have been in the paddock over here. Don't be in the grass, because they're hard to see. Alright, there's... Did he move, or is there a couple of them? Am I going crazy? <laughs> Probably. Turned in all pheasant hunt. Oh, there's anything wrong with that. I don't mind hunting pheasants. Oh, motorbike, loud motorbike. Oh, at least I can, uh, you know, at least my neighbour hasn't come out and mowed the lawn this stream. That usually happens on a weekend. Start the stream and the neighbour comes out. <coughs> oh, thanks, dude. <laughs> Let's look across this paddock because there is a red deer standing around the edges. Uh, where are you? Are you a different one? Man, you are just here somewhere. Please don't be in the grass. Makes him very hard to see. Can you see it? I see what I mean if it's in that grass. Oh, there it is. On, I can see it. It's on the other side there. Alright. I like the sounds of this map too. Pretty cool. You hear the trees creaking and stuff. You hear the ravens or crows, whatever they are. Hopefully he's in the clear. I did see his head. Yeah, he's he's in the clear. All right, cool, cool, cool. Oh no, he he he, he spied me. He took off the little bugger. All right, let's just keep. Uh... Oh, another one. Now you're behind me. All right, we're just gonna keep walking straight at this point. We're chasing uh, pheasants. <coughs> Haven't heard many road deer. Seriously, I usually hear a lot of them here. Because I ignore them, I don't road deer hunt that often. Obviously, they're not my favourite animal. In this or call the wild. Uh, are you in front of me? No, you're still behind me. What are they out there? Are they something? Pigs! You let me. Let's uh, set up for the pig armor. <coughs> I'm getting this shady spot over here in the dark. That one at the back's got tusks. Maybe the one at the front. They could be both males. Oh, and there's another freaking female. What's her face? Pheasant. Alright, spot. 
Oh, you're a big one. 950. So it'd be less than 950. They look, both look like they're male. So yeah, it's turned into a wild boar hunt and a pheasant hunt instead of a red deer hunt. It's unfortunate. Uh, I want to spot you. What are you? Alright, so this one here's the biggest. Don't look at me. I am not here, my friends. The wind's a bit of a bugger. So it blowing towards them. Alright, they're still both walking though. Just gonna let them get a tag closer and go a brain shot, man. No dog! Barking at dude, shut up already. Ah, that's good, the biggest one's taking the lead. Have another squeal. Laugh the dog was barking at a federal hog behind me and I got hit. It was trying to warn me. <laughs> like you dumb bugger. I tried to warn you, man. There's a female pheasant. Oh, did they just swap positions then? I think they did. I think he's our big one there. He is. He's still in the lead though, so that's good. Got nice tusks on him, doesn't he? He even looks bigger than the other one. Uh, one more squeal. Oh, with the right caller. And the right gun. That's it, buddy. Come on. I oh, might let him get it right on that road. And pop him. I should be. Oh, the, the wind's going that way, but it's not super strong. I'm in the shade, so it should be hard to see. I'm hoping. I don't know. He was going to run, then he's still moving towards me. Now I have to wait till he comes up. Damn, damn, why'd he stop? I must have hit it. Ah, uh, dog. You might have to do some tracking, mate. That wind, that was the wind then that just gave me away. You see him? Alright, looking for blood. Fucking pheasant. Oh, where's my pig tracks, man? You look like a pig. Blood. 
surely I hit it once, right? So I don't know if that's the right, there was two pigs. away from me. Uh, now I'm going to do the crazy walk. The up and down thing. Oh, is that a pheasant just sitting there? Well, there's a male too. Man, you kidding me, right? Ah, grab a bag a couple of pheasants while we're looking for this pig. Pick them up, they're females, though, so it's not going to be worth a lot. But it adds to the numbers. Uh, four. Great. I'm rich, man. I'm rich. <laughs> Maybe three. Two. Even less. Uh, where'd this frickin' the pig ran across the paddock? Why can't I find bloods and stuff? Here in frickin' what's the face? Oh, are you you geese? All right, don't want to know about you. There's a pig fleeing. I just want to check these tracks here. So far, no blood on any of these. Trotting. I may not have hit it. If I hit it, I may not have hit it really good. I've got roaming. Uh, another frickin' what's the face? Plenty of pheasants. Fling. Ah, uh, no blood on on this pig. I don't know if it's the right one. I'm hoping it is. What's this track here? It's a poop. Oh, I'm just going to go back to walking now. Damn that pig seeing me. This is pig area here and uh, pheasant. When you get like these, this area here. Let's just look in this next paddock over here. It's a lot of times I run together. Even though I'm only getting the one bloody pig track here with no blood. We've got a mushroom. I'm going to pick that up. i check that other track out there as well. Not a bad hunt. Was that a mushroom or am I just seeing things? I don't know. Yeah, it's just a mushroom. Oh, we just collect them. We don't get any money for them. <laughs> it's just the crazy thing you do. Oh, what track are you? Now, I'm not sure we hit this pig. And it shot a bit wild. Still fleeing. Alright, well, we're just gonna go back to a normal hunt. Well, there's another, there's a pheasant out there. 
Alright, no signs of our piggy. Alright, let's buy it again. There he is. Sometimes you do, you just see the one pheasant, the next minute another one, you know, you shoot at one, another one flies over your head. So is the shotgun loaded? It is loaded. Ah, oh, now I can't see it because we're in a dip. Make a noise, you little bugger. Get up here, might be able to see it. La, 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 la. Is that it there? Oh, there you are, there you are. Oh, it's very close actually. Just want to get a tad closer. Bad shot. Well, that one's going to live a long life of happiness. <laughs> I missed it. I can't get them all. Still no red deer, man. We do get less red deer on this side now. Unless you go near the tower, which is over there, that tower probably. I don't, I don't think that one, maybe. Plenty of geese now. I know that. Something flapping, is that a good geese? Sounds super close. There they go, then. Oh, heard another pheasant. Back over this way, is that the one we just shot at? Could be, could be. Let's just press Q and have a little walk without me pressing a button. That's always a good thing to do. Can't wait to eat today. I'm going to have uh, rice with uh, peri peri chicken. Or oh, chicken, uh, chicken legs. I like that meal. It's nice. It's sort of healthy for you too. I've spiced up all the chicken. So that'll be awesome. Oh damn you. Damn you. Oh man, I got butterfingers today, I tell you. And one of them days. Ah, oh, tell me it's just over here somewhere. I've missed as many as of I of, that I've hit today. I'm having an average uh, average aim hunt. Uh, let's see if we can see this little bugger.
Oh, is that? There he is. There he is, right in front of us. Alright, so I might just stop here. Oh, come on, dude. You're wearing your bulletproof jacket today. <laughs> when I miss her. Oh, I'll just keep walking. No crying over spilt milk. That's for sure. What I might do in a minute is head back to the other lodge and we'll try and get some red deer. What do you think? So, because we're just going to get pigs and... Uh, what's the face here? But if we head back to this lodge yes I am sure I want to travel to that location alright now we're sort of in more of a red deer area so let's put a little dot there oh fire's on let's just warm out little uh, tushes up before we leave ah uh, that's better there we are there as you can see, I'm wearing that today. I'm wearing the old uh, army gear. We'll just warm ourselves up a little bit. The dog will just think I'm an idiot. And go, what the hell are you doing, mate? Hey? Alright, let's just get back into it. What tracks are these right in camp? Ah, see, so they do have the wood grouse. I do have that crazy caller, but they are super freaking hard. I have gotten a few of them. And most of them from tower with the uh, with the bow and arrow. Because when you're on the ground, they actually, if you just move slightly or the wind blows, they uh, they tend to know you're there. We got them in Hammerdale. Let's have a walk around this area and see if we can find it. This is more of a red deer sort of area than where we were. And hopefully they call every now and again. The red deer hear your call but don't call back. And you walk along and you freaking scare them off. You see it run off. You go, no! I didn't want that to happen. So we'll see if we, we haven't gotten one red deer today. And I did put goose and red deer hunt. Well, the first hunt we got geese, we got pigs, and uh, now we've uh, this hunt we've got fallow deer, pigs, and pheasant. So you know, it'd be nice to get a red deer. I don't track it somewhere. Where to go? Uh, more a lot of wood grouse. Now I want red deer, my friends. I got a wood grouse here once from the tree stand. So, I think I've only gotten one or two from this map. But I was hunting red deer and foxes that day, so... It wasn't really my aim to uh, get wood grouse. Let's just cruise for a bit. Go into cruise mode. Oh yeah. So once you're in the game, I know the graphics are dated. But once you're in the game in some of these maps, it doesn't bother you. You just, you know, you just get immersed in it and it doesn't really worry you. Well, that's, you know, that's me anyway. That's how I feel about it. You could be different. Try and find some red deer tracks, man. I haven't even seen a red deer track. First time we did hear a female call. Then I think I shot a goose and they would have ran away anyway. So, you know. Ah, right, more wood grouse. That's grouse. Plenty of wood grouse. What's the time in the real world? No, not too bad. Have a little 
little bit more of a hunt, try and find a red deer. I'm looking forward to eating myself today. I've done all my shopping so I won't have to go out tomorrow. I have done everything. Did you get the odd wild boar around here too, so be careful. They will kill you. It's the only thing on the map that will kill you. Oh, they're in a female red deer calling. That's where you hear the trees creak a lot in here. It's a pretty cool sound. I don't mind it. Right, sounds like a tree falling. Hey, in the bed, no worries, Sarge. Thanks for popping in, mate. Hope you have a good Easter. Stay safe and uh, see you next hunt, buddy. Take it easy. Yeah, probably getting late in America now. In some parts. Ah, I don't want wood grouse. They want the red deer, my friends. Also, when I have a red deer, I, to, I go to Valdivar a lot because uh, you get more. We've got a fox, first fox of the day. We're not worried about her, didn't even bring a fox caller. Or a fox gun, or a bow and arrow. Every now and again, I don't bring a bow and arrow on a hunt. I just have a gun hunt. But I do love me bow and arrow in this game. It is awesome. Oh, there's a tower there. We might walk to that and have a call. And let's see what we get. But you do get a lot of pigs over there as well. I'm surprised we're not uh, even hearing a female red deer. You usually do. But yeah, but you can go out there and hunt pheasant all day. Um, just bring enough ammo, and uh, yeah. Hopefully your aim is better than mine. It's not that good today with the pheasants, but we did get a few. And they're a fun, yeah, they're a fun bird to hunt, really. Fox. Same one, same female. We don't want her. You get a few foxes in this uh, bush area. I usually go to my uh, tree stand here and fox hunt. You do get red deer there. We might walk to there. So we can call in a red deer. If not, um, yeah, I call quits. Go, uh, do some stuff and start my chicken. All right, I'm gonna say, maybe I might be able to fig through there. Physical trees, so. I just can't fit through the gap. All right, let me clean my map. Put a marker to there. Yeah, but this game still has a hardcore, you know, group of people that still play it. Which is good. I think this game will, uh, in another 10 years, it'll still have people playing it. As long as uh, EW keep, uh, keep it on. Imagine they will, as long as, you know, people play it. 
they must make a small amount of money off it. Some people probably, you know, use raw money to buy some of the stuff. I just hunt and save up. Of course, we used to put raw money in it. You used to have to pay for a season to hunt all the maps. And uh, I think you got free bullets if you done that for your guns. But then you had to buy your guns, your tents, your callers. You couldn't use... I think for GM, the only thing you could use that for was ammo. You can uh, use it for anything else, if I remember rightly. Maybe bear bait and stuff. Stuff like that. Pig bait. Maybe the barrels. Uh, we're going to stand up now. I don't know where the red deer are today. You do get them out there sometimes. That's why I go to this tower so I was going to call them. But uh, mainly you'll get pigs out there. I will have a little call here. It's actually a nice uh, view here. Really lovely spot. Let's get in the tower, the tower of power. It's only a small tower, this one. Oh, there's that freaking fox again that I don't want. Uh, I'm just going to get my dog to uh, lay down. Do a few calls, see what happens. I've gotten them here before, the red deer. They're very quiet today. I don't know what's going on. I haven't, I haven't heard one this hunt. We heard a female last hunt. We didn't see her, but we heard her. Let's call out this way. But if you play this game, you know exactly what I mean. Sometimes it's really red hot in areas with red deer, and other times it's just like, where the hell are they? But you can't, you know, I've walked around out there and I've gotten them, you know. I've gotten red deer out there, mainly up there at my tree stand, but all around the map. But it's just a, a matter of being in the right spot at the right time. Yeah, but I prefer Red Deer, Val de Bois, or whatever you call it. You walk along that river there and uh, just call it along. You get a fair few of them. But uh, I'm just not sure where they are today. I might go to Val de Bois and just try there. I'll have a hunt, a quick hunt there. So let me quit this. Go yes. Uh, stats. See what's free this week at Epic Games. Alright, I'll check that later. Alright, so we've got a few. One, two, three. Four, five, six, uh, what's a face? I just want to check this competition I was in. When I was coming second in, am I still coming? Uh, here, this one. Fight or flight, I'm still coming second. 
11 players, 11.54, I got 103.2. What does the history tell us on this thing from March 5? Uh, and the leaderboard on that day. So, so I could end up with a third. Looks like 1,000 is a pretty good uh, score. All right, so back to single player. Val de Bois. So we're going to start, yeah, this lodge here. And we'll just walk down here for a little bit and see if we can find a red deer. That's my aim. They do have brown bear here as well. Rabbits, uh, roe deer, the ibex up in the hills. So there's a few animals here, but we want to get a red deer. So I'm going to have to do it here, because I'm not going to have any luck at uh, Hirschfelden. Bing bong. Let's see if we can find one. Loading for this boss. Ah, dog's with me again. Ah, so we're going to head down to the river. Let's put a dot. And you get the rabbits in the burrows here, so they're pretty handy when you find the burrows. You can just sort of sit above them and uh, blast the weird the rabbits. It's quite fun. Alright, it's a cool freaking dog. I don't even know if it's following me. I like this, uh, along the river here is a nice map, and if you like the Ibex, it's pretty cool too. But to get up there, I had to put um, the ropes, and then I, I whacked the tent up there. So you had to put the ropes. Oh, that's the tent there, where the Ibex are around here. And I've got a tent up there. I do a lot of rabbit hunting and uh, fox and bear hunting up there. You get red deer up there as well. But mainly they're along here. So let's see how we go. See if we can find one or two. And hopefully they make a noise. Don't come up to me silently. Like some of the mule deer and that have been doing lately. That is a pain. I like them to make a sound. I know they're coming. It's a nice map, this one as, as well. I mean, Ali came here like a month ago, got some red deer, some bears, some rabbits. We had a pretty good hunt. You just never know. Yeah, so hopefully I can get a wild boar trophy, hey? If I maybe one thousand and thirty-four, if I can hold hold second, it'd be nice. I even get third. I just want a trophy, Matt. Let's check that again before I leave. I don't know if we get any EMs with that. It'd be nice if we do. Why so quiet, Red Deer? 
What is going on, mate? Are there a deer going on strike for Easter? Are they all going to the Gold Coast? A bit of a retreat? What is happening, mate? Gotta at least get one, right? One red deer. You're back. That was quick, man. What is it upgraded to? Super speed. I'll take care of some lag. Alright, All right, more rain. God damn rain every map I go to. Belt there. Oh, we're nearly at the river. Visibility is down. It's hard to see anything. Wi-Fi. Oh, that's the sound I want to hear. Oh, he's over this way. Alright, let's, uh, let's give him a call. Alright, we'll get on the other side of this rock, maybe. Where's my dog? Alright, I'll get my dog to lay down. Good girl. I am in the rock. What is going on? Can I get on the rock? Oh, is that a different one? Oh, same one, same one. Gonna come down from up there. Alright, so we have to change the map. Oh, you need a network cable. Yeah, I've got mine's in cable. I don't have it on Wi-Fi. I have mine hardwired. It's just the fastest way you can have it. So yeah, I'll do that. Let's go to key route uh, to the prone man. Prone up. Give a few uh, calls out there. Drop the rain stopped. Wind drop, rain drop. <laughs> I gotta speak. Uh, so it's gonna come over that hill. Somewhere over here. Or here. Just gonna be patient. Oh, we didn't even get to the river, mate. Sometimes you don't, and you get a call. There's a river down there. So I might be able to get me red deer straight off. Red. That's a loud caller, isn't it? Hopefully it uh everything's cool. 
Oh, did I load my guns? Always handy to have bullets in the chamber there. That was a nice deer that you uh, had in your... Yeah, it was. It was a beauty. I didn't even expect it. We were goose hunting. Before any goose came along, we had a call from a female red deer, so I was calling them, and the male come down. I think that's in the top 100 on the leaderboards. It's a nice uh, red deer. That's why I only had shotguns on me, but I did bring slug ammo in case something like that happened. That's why I shot it with the G10. And, uh, yeah. I think it, we got 88 GM for that one. So, a nice size uh, red deer, that one. Nice stag. Uh, I liked it. Biggest one I've gotten for a while, I'll tell you. Oh, hello. Oh, he's getting closer. He's walking a straight line. I'm hoping he comes through there. Maybe even there. We'll see his antlers before we see anything else. They're nice to red deer in this game. They're a lot bigger than the Call of the Wild ones. Look at the trees wobbling there, mate. They hypnotize you. Did Skippy come back? No, he didn't. He might have went and had his nap. Had a nana nap. There yeah, he's like. He was going to get a coffee and then he can come back. Unless he's sitting there silent. Show me the antlers. I bet it's really tiny. That's what happens sometimes. They sound really big and it, you see it and you go, oh, come on! It's as small as anything. But hey, I might be uh, cursing myself here. Jinxing myself. Got another call. I was talking with Ranger and we discussed the Red Deer season may be next week if you're interested. Ah, you mean in the what's the face in your competition? I'm not sure, mate. I'll think about it. I don't usually do competitions like that. We'll see, maybe. But I do like Red Deer and Call of the Wild. They're one of my favourite animals. Well, there he is. come up behind the trees making life uh, difficult I think the wind's good because it looks like the rain is blowing towards me there he is there he is no he's not very big it's just standard fare for this game it's small I uh, need you to walk out a bit ah, you can see him call man uh, 
Oh no, you're gonna you're gonna go in the cover behind the rock. I had to shoot him because I didn't know what he was gonna do. Ah, first red deer of the day, at least we did get one. Oh, red dead, red dead, not red deer. I read wrong. Yeah, maybe. I haven't played that game in ages. I've forgotten all the buttons. That's how dumb I'll be. I go, how do you do this again? How do you do that again? How do I punch my horse in the face again by accident? Oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we all have you gotta press F or whatever it is you nicky in GDA and you press the button like you get in the car and you punch your horse in the face and it runs off yeah, oh no I didn't mean it <laughs> Ranger was beating his horse yesterday oh, he's going he's been in there any hackers or modders or anything any crazy crap going on That's the only thing that turns me off on that game is you just got to keep swapping frickin' servers so you find one that maybe has no D brains on it. Trying to ruin everyone's game. Because that is a pain in the A. Apart from that, the game's really good. Skippy had come into that too, I'd imagine. Cause he used to love that game. <coughs> he used to love making us do all his stuff for him. <laughs> Very occasionally, not as bad. Yeah, probably because uh, not as many people play it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. People probably lost interest like we did because of all the modding and crap that went on. So they just ignore the game and then the modders have to go hassle someone else somewhere else there's a female red deer out there you have a boyfriend with you love I just wish uh, Rockstar would do what they've done for GTA have posse only sessions or friends only sessions and uh, that game would spark up again it's just because they're working on GTA 6 and they don't make as much money out of uh, Red Dead it's all about the cash there's a fox look if they made a ton of money out of that game then they do things that people want it the little fox you can only just see it Yeah, Red Dead. I thought you said Red D season. I'm like, oh, I don't know about that. Is that a male or female? It's walking like a female. Show yourself. I can't see. It's foggy. So the leaves are all blown that way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a female. I know, I don't know. Let's just keep calling, that could be a male. Stop, halt! In the name of me. I can't even see it, it's that freaking far away. Lift fog, lift. I'm not sure what I was looking at. Hey. 
I can't even see its butt. I can see its. Uh, okay, obviously it won't know I'm here. We're very far away. Where did you go? It's going to stand up a bit. Let's check these tracks. Track checker. I'm looking forward to eating today. I am hungry. I am hungry. I'm going to have my rice and chicken meal. I really like it. Even though we're having Kentucky tomorrow. And we're having a heap of chicken lately. I never complete these full uh, reserve missions because you've got to do everything while you're on here in the one hunt. I just don't even bother. Shut up, Fox. If that is a small male, as tiny as. Move! I'm here. Come. Come to me. I have some friendly fire for you. <laughs> There's a female. Cool. I want her. There was a small male. Yes, so Red Dead. Red Dead Redemption. Red Dead Redemption. Do, 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 do. Yes, my horses, the Mustangs, will, will be starved by now. Haven't been in that game that long. The Mustangs. Alright, you male. You know, stop. Sound like males, you females. God damn you. Alright, there's a female. There's the small male there. Why are you giving me all small red deers? Remember I done that video, Red Dead Deer Redemption, hey? <laughs> In Call of the Wild. Come on, it's gotta be something bigger than you, mate. You're gonna be worth 20 cents. to go for it. <laughs> Big hole in the lung, my friend. Oh, yeah. Alright, stand up. Alright, let's find where we can cross without drowning, since we can't jump. Because white avatars can't jump. Oh yeah. Come to me. And we'll just try around this corner. And then I'm going to go cook my dinner. Because I am hungry. What are we get? 20? 41. Alright, that's okay. I like it, even though it was small. <coughs> Let's run a bit here till we get past here. And we just shot a gun so it won't matter. Everything would have spooked in a hundred or so meters. Ah, right, we'll stop running. I'll run a little bit. Yeah, red dead. Red Dead Redemption. I just enjoy that game. When we go on missions and you know. 
you get to shoot a lot of a lot of stuff in that game i gotta learn all the buttons again i am like red dead redemption dumb now i have no idea it's been that long Oh, there's a, another small freaking male. That is tiny. Come on, mate. I come here to get me a big bugger. And find all the little fellas. Little todgers. You miss playing with the gang? Yeah, I know. We used to have a lot of fun. Yeah, I'd be able to make some videos and stream some of that too. I think all the people that used to watch me play that have left my channel, probably. I haven't played it for that long. They go, oh, look, he's not playing that game anymore, mate, that I like. You're a mongrel. I'm never coming back. I don't want that little red deer. That sucks. Yeah, it is. It's like a little baby one, a little teenager. It's like he just wandered off from his mum by accident. I'm not even going to shoot at it. Because there might be a bigger one down the track a bit. And, uh, you know, it's scary. Look at them little... They, they belong on a bloody white tail, them antlers, mate. Oh, red deer. You bastard. So yeah, I don't want him. I don't want you, my friend. Better that crazy red deer because it's too small. We say you get more red deer on this map than uh, Hirschfelden. Even though at the moment they're all small, but uh, at least they're here. I have brown bear on here, so they can kill you. Usually they make a sound, you know, they're right next to you. And and they will charge you, which is pretty cool. There he goes. He's off. Run back to mum, little boy. Nobody wants you here. They're not worth shooting. I am in a red deer competition. You've got to shoot through the heart, but all the ones I've seen today. Uh, wouldn't even get me in the top 100, mate. No? They're all crazy small. How is Ranger anyway? Still going hard in GTA? Must be about level 400 or something by now. That's for sure. Oh, I oh, woke up early today. Took down this patch of water. Level 470 plus. I knew it. I knew it. Last time I saw him, he was like level 300 and something. I thought, well, that'll be over now. He'll be way above that. But there it is there. Look how tiny that is. It's like, are you kidding me, man? Is that a bloody joke, mate? Are you joking? You're joking? You're joking? Yeah, so that's not worth shooting. 
Because it could be a bigger one that I can't see. It's too smart to show itself. Set there, something moving. Ah, female, female, female. Look at it. I've seen uh, white tails with big antlers, mate. Damn you, bastard. God damn it. Looks like I'm not going to get a big one today. That's what I'm thinking. Looks like an axis deer. Yeah, I know. It's very small. I know I refuse to shoot small ones sometimes. I'm like, yeah, whatever. I'm not doing it. Yeah, if I was in a tree stand with a bow and arrow, then I'd probably take it just for, you know, the extra cash. When I'm shooting with guns, I tend to ignore smaller ones. Another female. Plenty of them. bit more and I'm gonna go log off and go start cooking my dinner meat <laughs> I grabbed my bag yesterday I thought I'll go to the supermarket you know grab some bread and a bit of food for today I walk all the way down and I go geez the car park's pretty empty it was closed it's a, it's a, this supermarket's usually open on Good Friday but uh Nah. They usually open on Good Friday and they got a an alcohol area and they close the alcohol area but you can buy all all the normal food and stuff. Uh, yesterday they didn't open for the first time in like, I don't know, twenty years. Oh, okay, okay, so I walked all the way down here for nothing. So it sort of sucked. Oh, um, who called me? It was a mile. Where are you? Near the river. Can I not see you? Oh, it's not. Oh, look, that's even a smaller male. Come on, game. You're kicking me butt here, man. That can't be it, can it? Damn you. I thought that was a female over there. It's a male with hardly any antlers. If I was in a competition for smallest male red deer, I'd win. I'd win with that piece of crap over there, don't you worry. Hey? Look at it. Look, it looks like a female coming at you. It's a male. Go home. Who call you here? Who speak? Get out of town, Jack. Unbelievable. Preschool, all right. That dude belongs in kindergarten, mate. But no matter how small they are, they call big. Like you hear, and you go, oh, that could be a big one. Then it comes around the corner, you go, oh, come on. Look at it. I saw it way back. I thought it was a female. But, uh, you know, maybe if you had three legs, I'd shoot you. Or you had five legs, and I'd stuff you and put my. Uh, Lodge is a weirdo. Move. Ah, oh, come on, show me one big one. The first one we got looks like it's going to be the biggest one of the day. And even that was average. What about a, give me a brown bear? They're pretty cool. The brown bears here are nice. Oh, another female. There's a bit bigger male over there. So they're around. 
trying to avoid the small ones. Oh, something just ran at the back. Oh, or, or was it you there at the front? Right, where'd that other male go that was sort of okay? They all run. What is going on, game? I'm crouch, mate. Uh, is that it there? Yeah, that's it there. Damn, that's pretty average as well. There's another female there. Where are the decent males, man? Not gonna give me one today? Uh, are you up there? Yeah, are you over there? These headphones are bloody crazy. These are the totally opposite direction of where the thing called from. Ah, uh, that's the one we saw earlier. Oh, there's another one over there. Not very big at all either. How come that red deal is weird? That's tiny as well. Oh, they're there, behind me. That's what we're looking for. Always look around, my friends. Look at that. Now, that'll be the best one of the day. Still not super cool or super huge, but we'll take it. Oh, yeah. All that corn along this river has brought them all out. All right, now, hopefully the wind is kind to me. There he is, look, I just see the tips of his antlers there. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Come over the hill, boy. I want you to come over that hill. That's why you never shoot at the small ones. Because you just don't know what's going to happen, you know? Oh, there is two big ones. There's one there and there's one even closer. I think I've only got one bullet in this freaking gun. Oh, wrong gun, wrong gun. Stop, stop that. And oh, no, I got five, I got, got five, got five. I must have had one bullet and shot it. Dog! Freaking lay down. Don't be a pain in the butt, mate. Uh, I've got little red deer that I don't want there. It can spook everything off now. Now, I can't see my big ones. Look at him. If he triggers everything, can spook. I am surrounded. Oh, he ran. You ran, please, big ones don't run. No, 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 no! I think I can make it stop. We didn't shoot a gun. I'm sure there were two big ones. Or am I just stupid? Don't answer that question. <laughs> I'm probably just stupid. If we get one big one, I'm not going to complain. Alright, he's still there. I'm sure there was another one. It might have went up the hill. Uh, he's not huge, but to what we've been seeing today, that's nice. I'll take a shot, man. Give the deer a sporting, sh you know, chance.
pretty sure we hit it. Yeah, we hit it. Obviously didn't hit it in the heart, but eh. Let's run! We can run now. Oh, yeah. I knew that when them small ones come, they'd spook, and then that's like, sometimes it's game over. But uh, it didn't spook that far, and we made it stop, which is good. Alright, it said it went up to 260. I doubt it's going to be that big. Might be 200. 220. It's a lot better than what we've been seeing. So, let's check it out, mate. So, I went the long shot. I thought we'll give it a sporting chance. Because, uh, you know... How does it feel like that with these deers, don't you? Oh, what you can do if you've got your dog on you is then uh, tell your dog to track that sucker down, even though you know it's dead and it's there. Um, and then your dog will just totally ignore you. I don't know, is it going to track it? What's it doing? Come on, girl, you can do it. It's just there. Just helps your dog level up that little bit. Oh. There you go. She found it. She's barking. Good dog. Alright, not huge. Not like the one we made the little video about. Well, there's some nice handlebars on it, though. Alright, put them on a Harley. It'll look pretty cool. Alright, we hit the right long shoulder blade at uh, 134. We're going to hit 65. It's a 214. So I said maybe 220. 200, 220. 214. So in between there, that's not too bad. Better than all the ones we're looking at. Yeah, if you like Red Deer, this uh, Val de Bois is a nice map to come. Just walk along this river, call like crazy. And, uh, yeah, you'll get some. And when you get past the... Uh, usually when you get past... Or right over here. This hut is when you'll start to get a lot of the bear around there. That's why I got the bear barrel there. Because uh, I used to, you know, fill it up and then uh, sneak on down and uh, shoot me a few bear. You don't need it. You don't need the bear barrel. But uh, it's nice to have if you're in a comp. To, uh, you know. Seems just like real life. Dog ignoring you. I know. Oh, it, ended up, it ended up going for it. But uh, it stood there for a bit. I had this dog. Uh, I haven't had it out for ages. What level are you now, girl? You are level 32. Mother dog's level 40. That's the dog I made the video about, this dog. We do a video when I got it the first time and uh, we took it out and uh, started training it and do all that stuff you do with the dogs. Just, uh, you know, level it up slowly. I don't feed them cookies or anything. I don't do that crap. I just, uh, you know, dog's got to earn its... Uh, Leveling by, you know, this one tracking and the other one picking up birds, which we used today in the first video. And then it got stuck on a blind, and I have to go pick all the birds up. So yeah, the dogs glitch out in this game also. So <laughs> yeah, you gotta make it earn its keep, mate. As you can feed it cookies in this game, and that levels it up. But I don't do that. I just think, uh, well, what's the use? Just I like things leveling up at a normal pace and not, um, you know, not trying to uh, force the issue. Uh, I'll have another little walk down. I'm going to log because I'm hungry. It takes a bit over an hour for the chicken to cook and all that stuff. At least we got some red deer. The new retriever in Call of the Wild is good for bird hunting. That's what I use my retriever for in this game. Pick up the geese, the ducks. Pheasant. The only thing the dog can't pick up is the turkey. Because they're a bit too big. So it won't pick up turkeys. But other than that, it does all the birds. 
If I haven't had this dog out in ages, and I thought, oh, I had the retriever out today, might as well bring out this dog. I bought this dog with jams as well. Saved them up and then I uh, got the dog. I don't spend real real money on this game anymore, like in the old days. Because, uh, why would you? Alright, we've scared all the red deer off by shooting the gun. Jolly good. <laughs> Any bears? Maybe, see if we can travel to this, uh, here. Yes, I can. I'll try and get a bear. Oh, go away, Roe dear. Nobody likes you. You suck, my friend. You suck. Alright, there's my dog. Yep. Alright, so I'll walk down the river here. Because, uh... From here, sort of, to like the barrel, every now and again you will find bear along here. They seem to like this part more. We still get red deer as well. And we'll check it and see if we'll find a brown bear mat. They do like the water. And you will get them in the hills and that as well, but I usually find most of them just walk along here. So we we will see. No worries, man. Take it easy, and uh, talk to you on our Discord soon about um, once human, and we'll get that happening, mate. It'll be awesome. Have a good day, bud. Have a good Easter. Have a safe Easter, that's for sure. <coughs> Does sound good. Catch you later, bud. <coughs> oh, go away, Rody. Oh, there you are, a male. It's just up there. I didn't bring a gun to shoot it with. And as you know, if you've watched me long enough in Call of the Wild on this game, I don't really hunt roe deer that much. Although there's a ton of them here now. They're all calling like crazy. But we don't want them. See, those big red deer didn't make a sound today, did they? All the small ones were calling, but the big ones just sort of snuck on in. None of them made a... You know, a call. Which I hate sometimes. Because you don't know they're there. And if I didn't turn around and look behind me, I wouldn't have seen it. <coughs> That's one of the reasons I don't shoot the small ones. Because there could be a big one just over the hill. Just around a corner. You didn't see it yet. You know? But you'll see it running off after you shoot the small one. You go, no! Oh, come on, bears. Don't let me down. Let's see if we can get a bear. Just to, you know, cap the hunt off. When I used to have the barrel, you know, I got the barrel here, but I've got no bait in it. When I used to have the bait in it, there'd always be bears. Every hunt. And then where I placed it, like you'd shoot them, and then they'd run down there, and it was a bit like a test tube. They'd go up here, and you'd be able to shoot multiple bears. Oh, it's a wood grouse. Here, yeah, wood grouse, we just walked past it. Is 
they're a good addition to the game. The old wood grouse, they look alright too. Come on, bear. Come on down. Getting closer to the barrel area. Well, once again, no bait in it. But you do get bears crossing there, so I put the barrel there. So I used to get a lot of bears there anyway before I even had the barrel. So that what? I'll whack the barrel here. <laughs> Seems like a good bear area. It could be a bit early. Bears sleep in, I think. They get up till about 11 o'clock. Bloody bludgers. But every time I hunt here, except for today at the moment, you usually do get a brown bear or four. You usually get a few. Go away, Rody. He'll scare my bears off. Have been killed by him here too, so. As long as you're walking here, you're looking there, and they come out over that hill, and boom, they whack your one. Like, no, you killed me. Oh man, come on, bears. How much can a koala bear, mate? It's pretty good because you usually see them in the distance. They, you know, take a bit of a long shot at them. I always hit the lungs. It's good. They will run with long shots in them, but you know, then they do eventually just drop down dead. So. Uh, getting closer to that area. I'm not a bear in sight. What is going on? Mate. Uh, look, the red deer are just walking on in. I'm, when I'm calling red deer. Stupid things. I've been up in hills hunting rabbits too, and uh, you get bears up there as well. And a lot of foxes. There's the barrel. Like I said, it's not loaded, so. But if it was, you'd come here and there could be four to five bears. Which is always cool. And then they run, you know, when you shoot one, a lot of them then take off down to that test tube area. Have you run on down? Oh, there's a bear. There we go. This is why I put the barrel here, because you just come here and there'll be a bear anyway. It's female, but it's not a male. Uh, I don't want to shoot it in the butt. So I'm going to try and get a bit sideways to it if I can. Oh, 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 yep. It's going to give me a, going to give me a look at its lungs. Oh, wrong gun again. Go away, shotgun. They run quick. I hit it in the neck. I was hoping we could travel through to the line. Let's see what we've done. They will run. If you don't hit them good, they will run for a long bloody time and confuse you. should be down here. Uh, not you. Maybe you. You. I was telling me intestines, it will die. 
I talk to you stuff, mate. Do what I pay you to do. Uh, I said the dog uh, get out the freaking water. It'd be a good thing. Uh, some more blood. I think we hit it a second time though. More blood? Well, it's bleeding a lot. But then that'll dry up and sort of stop. Then it'll run like a big bugger, mate. But it's a nice area for bears here. If you're a bear hunter. And if you do have the barrel, it's a nice spot to put it there. And they come down from either side. Oh, this seems to be bleeding a lot. Uh, we'll track it too. Let's get our bear tracking up. And just walk behind the dog so we don't confuse it. Good girl. It wasn't a male. They pay a bit better than the females. But in intestine shot, well, usually it'll bleed out. It just takes a fair while. It's also something we get a second shot in and uh, just give it another wound to its body somewhere. Preferably, you hit the lungs. And even then, they'll still run. And they just won't run far. But let's see. Let's see. Plenty of tracks. Ah, still bleeding. Bleeding good. So what do we do? Go through the neck and then hit it in the intestines? Or what? What is giving on me? Let's hope we go through the neck and hit the lung. Ah, follow the old dog over there. Oh, it's found it. Good dog. Oh, yeah, man. Didn't get as far as I thought it would. Ah. Oh, we did hit it the second time in the hip. So, we went through the neck there. Missed them lungs altogether. The bullet must have bounced off. I went there, and then we hit it in the hip bone. 37. So, yeah, not too bad. We'll have one more look down near this river on this side here. Make sure we reloaded. Uh, oh, the right, right gun. Yep, let's got five bullets in it. So, we need to see one more bear, and then I'm going to log guys and uh, go cook dinner. Like I said, it's going to take a little while to cook and uh, can't rush these things. If you want tender chicken, there's another bear track there, another female. So around this part of the map, you will find uh, more bear than uh, red deer. Another bear. But they do like it here. I think it's because of the water and bears come to get the fish and all that sort of stuff in real life, so it happens here as well. Usually you will be shooting them at a bit of a distance, which is fine. Sometimes I bring the 4570, and that does a bit more damage than the 7mm. That's a pretty powerful gun in this game. See, this bit ends up like a test tube. I hear wood grouse. Wish the fog wouldn't uh, be here. Without fail, usually you come here and you'll you'll get a few bear. But because I'm you know I'm nearly out of time, 
we might only be getting that one. There are more bear tracks there. All female at the moment, no males. Oh, there, there's the bear. She's heard me. Ah, uh, so I've hit this bugger. I looked uh, like an orangey one, huh? More than red. Alright, let's look for blood! The blood! The bare blood. Alright, should have tracks over here somewhere. It was running away when we shot at it, so maybe it hurt us. Uh, there's a poop. You see your tracks here, girl? Is this you? Ah, blood. Oh, body. Hopefully we've hit it a couple of times. Come on, dog. Do your thing. Ah, no intestines this time. As long as Fiona hit the body, oh, the dog stopped. That usually means because the bear's still running pretty fit and healthy. Alright, let's try again on this track, girl. Where are you? Oh, they're getting hooked up on rocks. See a track ahead of us. Oh, she's sitting again. Ah, right, let's just run. That's a roaming track that sucks. As the problem sometimes with the bears is they, they're around the area. So you'll find roaming tracks, fleeing tracks, roaming tracks, fleeing tracks. Uh, now I'm going to have to do like a grid wide search. Because she's stopped. Because obviously the bear isn't that injured. a bummer. Not bad for shooting bad roaming poop. Let's check this track. Stop giving me roaming tracks. Damn, roaming, 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 all the fleeing tracks. I gotta go back down. So then it went to Rome after we shot it. Oh, it should be fleeing for all it can. Uh, this should be fleeing track here, I think. Fleeing. And you're telling me you went up. Let's go across a bit. Like maybe it went to roaming. I thought, what was that? Like a mosquito bit me? Because we shot it so bad. I'll just double check. Yeah, maybe you did go back to roaming? Like, that'd be weird. It did. Uh, 
but hey. Uh, let's check these again. Yeah, see, 3 to 28 minutes ago, that should be the right one. On that poop. Romy. Seriously? Hold it, just roam. That's a problem when you hit a bear bad. That almost rhymes. When you hit a bear bad, it's a bad thing. Just, <laughs> just gonna keep running or walking or whatever the hell these things are doing. These are the right tracks. Fleeing, all right, we've got to flee. Surely it went up. But I've done this before and sometimes you don't find it because, I don't know, they run a bit crazy. Oh, here we go, straight line. If it goes too high up, I won't even be able to get up there. Alright, fleeing, saying it went up like this way. Wish I could see it like there and just shoot it and make it fall off a mountain, it'd be awesome. It's trying to go up, isn't it? Look at it. Fleeing. Fleeing. There's Got more over here. It's not bleeding. Stop bleeding. Fling. Fling. It's way to this thing go. Roaming. See the problem when you don't hit a bear good? Fleeing. We're in, uh, nearly in the Ibex country, mate. I'll be able to find us an Ibex. If you're lucky, sometimes you see him in the distance, you get that vital shot in you need. Surely didn't go up there because I won't be able to get up there. I might end up killing myself here. Ah, oh, there's a track there. Oh no, no, no! Alright, well, looks like I've died. <laughs> That happens. We're going to end the hunt there. I'm just going to check this uh, pig competition. I'm in to see where I'm standing with that. Uh, I'm going to get a letter off uh, What's the Face. That's alright. That bear will live forever because we didn't hit a vital. I really want to eat. So let's quit this. We'll check where I am in this competition. We did get one bear. And we shot another one. And, uh, you know. I got 25. So we've got a bear. We've got a few red deer on that hunt. So let's go to... Here. Alright, so I'm still coming second in this one. When does it end? It ends in one day, one hour. So 11.54 is the biggest one. Leaderboard. I got 1,032. You reckon I'll be able to hold that? Or even get third? Now that's a pretty big ball. I've got a couple of 900s and then go down to 700. So if I'm lucky, 
Because I want to get that. Like a trophy and get 50 M's. Or even 25. Like when we did look at the history. Look at January's history. So that seems 11.55 seems to be... Yeah, see? Only two got in the 1,000s, which I'm in. Let's look at September. 11.53, leaderboard. Ooh. So that one, if it was that one, I'll miss out. But anyway, we'll, we'll hope and uh, pray that I can... Um, Get second would be nice because I don't have a uh, wild boar trophy. I got a feral hog one, no wild boar one. So hopefully we can. Uh, that was the last one we got. Was that that was the St. Patrick's Day campaign? Twenty uh, pheasant you had to get, and I got some M's and uh, a tent. There's the Christmas one, and then in between that we got a big horn gold and a. Bison gold, so hopefully we can get something with that uh wild boar would be nice. Anyway guys, thanks for keeping me company. I'm gonna end it there. I'm gonna go eat. It's uh like four o'clock in the afternoon here and I won't be eating until about five thirty. So yeah, thanks for keeping me company. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll catch you on the next one. Have a safe Easter guys and I'll catch you uh maybe tomorrow, if not tomorrow, maybe Easter Monday. So yeah, just look out for me, I'll probably be on. And uh, 